I don't know if you guys can see that, but it is gnarly out on the lake. What is up dudes and welcome back to another exciting episode of Fishing More Outdoors. If you guys are new here and haven't seen my face before, hello, my name is Murda and uh, yeah, we do lots of like fishing and outdoors and just basically like awesome videos like this one every single day. So yeah, if you guys are new here and enjoy this video really quick. Do me a favor, smash that subscribe button. Also really quick, thanks so much for taking time out of your day to click on this video and give it a chance. And I hope, uh, yeah, I hope you guys are very entertained. As you guys can, I'm sure you can see in the title down below, um, I am with my, I'm with my, one of my good buddies, uh, Maverick. He makes YouTube videos also. If you guys haven't heard of him, I'll link him down below. Go check him out. We're probably doing the least smartest thing we have done all year. Me and Maverick are attempting to do some ice camping slash catch and cook. We literally have 40 mile an hour winds and we have to set up a pop-up portable and we, we have a we have a bunch of stuff. It's I, I don't think it's going to be very good. I'm not even 100% sure if we're going to be able to even set up the portable. We might just lose the thing. I'm glad we brought Mavs and I might. But yeah, uh, I'm not sure how much filming we're going to do until we set up the portable because it's just freaking gnarly out. Here, let me just open the door. Let me just open the door real quick. It's freaking bad out, but... Anyways, we only have like an hour till till the sun goes down, so I gotta start hurrying up. We got a bunch of stuff to load out. We're gonna have to make like two, three trips, so yeah, stay tuned. Dude, this is nuts. Yeah. Like this is nuts. Yeah. I think it might be. Like this is not smart. No, it's not very smart. We're gonna lose some. Something's gonna go bad. I just know it. <laughs> I'm scared. Yo! Oh my god! Huh? What? Are we just gonna set up in a random spot? Why? <laughs> you should probably drill some holes. Oh. Yeah. You know what I mean? Probably kind of try to find something. I ain't even gonna lie, dudes. This whole video might be a complete shit show. It's getting dark too. We need to drill a hole or two just to. Oh. Just to find a good depth. We only got to make like two more trips. Ah! Dude, I can't even look this way. We just say screw it, sit up here. That's fish, ain't it? 20 feet. Looks pretty good, 21. What do you think? I don't know. Like normally if I'd come do this, I'd drill a hundred holes and like kind of catch a fish first and then set up, but we don't really have time. Yeah. And and we're marking fish right here. I'm not marking nothing. Yeah, you are. Where? Maybe on bottom. Up there? All right, we'll set up here. Check this thing out, dudes. Huge shutout clam. Freaking anchor attachment. Or like drill attachment. That's so cool. I'm just gonna straight up it like this. So we'll hook that up first. Probably keep it right where it is right now too. Yeah. I think that'll probably be perfect length. And we'll just hook it up and try to pop it up from there. Yep. I feel right. like the wind's dying down a little bit right now, so let's do this fast. Whoa. You're, oh, this, yeah, this you're, is a good way to do it. You're crazy. This thing's breaking for sure. That's a good idea. All right, dudes, we're all to options. 
We need to drill holes next to the portable and use the slush to put it on the fish house to keep the freaking walls from blowing down or blown away. All right, dudes. Not sure how we pulled it off, but we pulled it off. We got the freaking portable set up. Matt, that was crazy. Yeah. Both of our cameras died too, by the way. We didn't bring our camera bags out there. We just had our chesties, so. I'm not sure what you guys have all seen yet, but we definitely almost lost that portable like three times. I'm still waiting to like see if we can watch it just blow. I know, <laughs> I know, it's way out there. But anyways, yeah, we gotta make one more trip, hopefully. And we should be good with one, yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll probably uh, just see you back out in the portable. Stay tuned and cross your fingers we don't lose it. All right, dudes, we're getting everything pretty dialed. It is time. I'm sweating. It's time to take out the bibs. Yeah. Take your spring break. Take your towel off. Heck yes. That's way better. But I'm gonna show this off for now, dudes. Just until we. Oh, sorry. Just until we get fully ready. And my camera's kind of foggy and whatnot. And this camera sucks. And I only have four batteries to last us the entire night. So yeah. Stay tuned. Now they're gone. So you think there's fish here? Is what you're saying? Could be. Could be? Yeah, could be. All right, dudes. How do I look? Can you see me? Yeah, you look hot, honestly. I am using my uh, GoPro because my camera sucks. My batteries are like complete trash. Like they don't even work. So, doo -doo. Yeah. after rearranging like three times, we finally got her all dialed. Let's uh, give you a quick walkthrough. Mav, want to show us your neck of the woods first? Yeah, so this is my, uh, my humble abode. Uh, I have two ice holes. Drilled that are covered by the, <laughs> covered by the cot right now, and uh, I got an extra tall cot here. This is the same one that I used to like camp in my flip over, so that's why it's so tall. But it's nice because I can store like cooking supplies and stuff underneath it. Yeah, um, got a zero degree bag. But you stay a little warmer too. Stay a little warmer off the ground, exactly. Mine's like six inches off the ground. Yeah, that's nice. But... All right, that's that's Mav's neck of the woods. Here's my hum humble abode. How do you say that word? Humble abode. Here's my bed. <laughs> it's only like six inches off the ground. I got it at twenty. I got it for like twenty dollars at Walmart. Just like my two fish. years ago. And then this is really cool. Man, I brought a table. I've never camped with a table. Oh my god. Man. Okay, this is actually a surprise for me from Mav. Yeah. I haven't had sushi <laughs> since. Little backstory. Me and Mav used to live together for like like two years ago yeah dude we used to eat sushi all the time and i haven't had sushi since so i brought him some since then i'm freaking fired up yeah so yeah we got the table we got uh mr buddy vexar freaking yeah i don't know we're dialed buddy we're, we're good to go we're dialed we basically got all the gear and uh yeah hopefully the only thing we can hope for now is fish a ca to catch a fish yeah like we literally drilled <laughs> we literally <laughs> just fish. set up the portable in the middle of this basin so <laughs> Hopefully we can, I'm just gonna put a minnow and a bobber down or something and hopefully we can have some fish roll through. All right, dudes, we officially got the rod all set up. We got a bobber down with a nice fat head on it. Mavi, it's a freaking sushi time? It's sushi time, buddy. I'm starving, let's get her going. All right, so we got the spicy salmon roll. Uh, just tuna, regular tuna sushi. It's just like tuna fillets and yeah, rice. Like, They're like good. These. I like both of these, I know um, that. That's good with soy sauce and wasabi. And then this is shrimp tempura, so it's just like a breaded shrimp. Here, take it off. Yeah. This is shrimp tempura, so it's got like breaded shrimp on it, and then okay. I think avocado and cucumber. Yeah, looks like it. What's and then this? this is salmon. They're these are both the same, so these are both shrimp tempura. This is oh, okay. just spicy, regular, regular. This is salmon, obviously. Okay, tuna. yes, sir. Um, soy sauce packets, where'd those well, end up? In the hole. Okay. I got two so for you here. We have plates here. Oh, put, yeah, okay, cool. Put those on there, all right, dudes. First official bite, we're going with the shrimp shrimp tempura. Shrimp tempura. Oh, she's breaking on you. Oh, it's no. It's breaking on me. Yes, sir. <laughs> oh, my <Yeah>. God. <laughs> That's so good. You miss it? I miss it. I, this is going to die, so I'm just going to eat this. But it's bomb. Dude, try one of those, uh, either the tuna or the salmon. It, like, melts in your mouth, bro. What one? Either I'm one. I'm going to go for salmon, that. Put some uh, soy sauce on it. Look, this is... I'm not kidding. It's the best sushi I've ever had. Yeah? Yeah. Hell yeah. I'm glad you like it, dude. Everything does always taste better when you're camping, though. Yeah. But. That's true. Oh my god. I just did a video where I did a Carolina Reaper pepper cheese. Like the hottest pepper. 
on a, on Dude, a burger. Dude, you're really blowing me away today. <laughs> Why? Dude, everything is so good. The salmon? Yeah. yeah it's this, melting in my mouth. Yeah. What's the, up? That's like my favorite. Look it's like ice butter. Ice cream cone. Yeah. All right, dudes. Just got done eating sushi. Mav, once again for the hundredth time. <laughs> You're welcome, dude. You're, You're a real so one. <laughs> oh wow! I almost tipped mine over right there. <laughs> sushi. Anyways, I wanted to show you guys this real quick. This is kind of what I'm dealing with. As you could see, I think I Mav says I need to buy new batteries. It might be the case. Yeah. I hope that's the case. Yeah. The camera's already pretty dick, but okay. Fully charged. I'm about to take this out. Put it in my big camera. Throw that one here. Turn it on. It's either gonna say completely dead or it's gonna say completely full. And I'm gonna I'm gonna watch it. It's gonna it's gonna literally shut off. As you can see here, it says fully charged. This thing's only gonna last like 30 seconds and it's gonna shut off. Like, dude. I have the worst luck ever with cameras. Yeah. That's, I'd say. It's so weird. I can't believe it hasn't shut off already. Watch now it just yeah, riffs. No, just now fine. it just riffs the whole That's time. How it works. All right, let's talk until that goes. What's new, Mav? Uh, nothing much, dude. Just uh, enjoying a nice view of Nesquik. It's gone. I drank it. <laughs> I wish I had like ten of them. I might go to sleep early. It's like it's like midnight, right? I think it's like seven. Close enough. <laughs> like it, it's, it still hasn't. Dude, yeah, you're. You're just gonna have to take my word. This camera sucks. I'm actually so since it's ripping, I'm gonna do this. Shut it off. And that way, if, like, I catch a fish or something, which probably won't happen. <laughs> <laughs> There's the optimism we're looking for. <laughs> but, yeah, I don't know. I'm just going to keep that there off. I got my GoPro set up here right on my bed. I accidentally turned it on. <laughs> GoPro, stop recording. Oh, that was yours. Anyways, yeah, so Weekly's got one camera. I just have to yell at it, turn it on, in case my bobber goes down or something, so. Yeah, stay tuned, dudes. Hopefully something cool happens. Worst, come to, worst comes to worst, we'll just have to, uh, if we don't catch any fish all night, I'll probably, like, do some hole hopping in the morning or something, because I can't go fishing without catching at least one fish, but, yeah, I don't know. I'm sure we'll be goofing around and having a good time anyways, so. Yeah, stay tuned. Mav's taking pictures of me. Holy bucket! Switch. Oh! Oh my god, that was sick. Oh my god! <laughs> Little update, dudes. Me and Mav are. Can you see me? Yeah. Me and Mav are. Uh... You guys probably don't know this, but Mav is like super into fingerboards. Oh yeah. And I'm he he got you got me into it. Yeah, dude. He gave me a board and stuff, so we're this is our update. We're playing skate. We're playing skate because the fish biting her isn't really happening. Yeah. So. Rock, Rock paper, paper scissors, scissors shoot. shoot. Rock, Wait, hold on. Paper, scissors, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go scissors. Okay. Rock, Rock paper, paper scissors shoot. shoot. <laughs> Works every time. I should have freaking gone to. Works every time. Alright, you ready? Pop shove it. I skipped it. No. I landed it. I didn't see it. Epic, if you don't, you can see it in the video. Can you do it? Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. That was hard for it. Are you sure? Yeah. That's a pop shove it, bro. That's, that was more of one. That was, that was right one. But yeah. here, just I, go again. You're gonna have to do it again because that first one is pop shot. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, flip. That's all I had. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. We've been chilling for a while now. It is currently eight o'clock. It's eight fifty-six, and I don't know. We haven't for sure marked anything until now. I just had a freaking. He's still there. Other than that, super slow tonight. I mean, we're kicking it. We're having fun. We quit playing skate. We didn't even finish our game of skate. <laughs> I would have won. Yeah. So I think that's why Matt quit. But no, but I don't know. Our confidence isn't very high tonight, but I, I definitely think we are probably going to do some hole hopping in the morning and stuff. So, uh, yeah. Hopefully we'll have some fish getting caught in this video. Holy buckets, dudes. Little update. It is currently 
1019. Mav's going to bed on me. I just had a pee break. And it's freezing outside and windier than piss. Like, holy buckets. Nothing cool's happened. Me and Mav just literally... Mav's... Are you sleeping? Mav's sleeping. So... Yeah. Stay tuned. <laughs> Another little update, dudes. It is currently 12-12. 12, 12. Mav's... He was sleeping for a little bit, but he's rolling around. He's rolling around again, but... Like, nothing cool has happened. Like, at all. I've been laying here for the past three hours on Snapchat. That's it. I've watched a few TikToks, too. It's not looking good. I'll probably, I'll probably turn this back on and talk to you guys before I go to bed. Which, for you guys, it'll probably be in, like, two seconds. It is currently one o'clock vlogging off my phone right now but it's so gnarly outside i'm gonna go to bed stay tuned i'll see you in the morning Marking and catching. That's that's a better one. Got that one on Murray's rod. Uh, just to let you know, there was a giant gaping hole underneath the ice house. That's why we were so cold. The wind blew it open. Surprised we didn't take off. All right, well, I'll catch you. Catch you later. Sayonara. Any snuggle butt? What, man? I think there's a fish on your dingum and dinger. It was marking. I'm a working. I'm making. Oh! <gasps> what? What's going on down there? Oh, that was me. <laughs> Stinker. Stupid. You really stupid. Yeah, you kind of really stupid. Do you hear what I said about the freaking house? No. There was a giant, like, air hole, like a gap underneath this side from the wind blowing under it. Really? Yeah, like the air was like like directly like coming into the house. I can't believe it didn't pick up and like just blow away. Is that why I'm freezing right now? Well, I've covered it up with snow now. Dude, I'm so cold. You're you're so old. Cold. Wait, how old are you? All right, dudes. It's nine o'clock. I'm finally getting out. Ah. We can't catch another fish, so I finally talked Mav into cooking up these crappies because we need to eat something and leave soon. <laughs> Before yeah, we, this, this thing is ridiculous. Thing. Yeah, we're gonna lose this house soon. This side keeps popping in, this side's popping in, that side's popping in, Mav's popping in. Stay tuned. Mav's gonna cook this fish. Do you know how to cook fish? No. I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna film them and whatnot, so. Woo! I haven't cleaned a crop in forever, yet on a six inch or so. So it's gonna be brutal, is what you're saying? Could be. Oh, you're just doing that away, huh? Is that not how you're, you do it? No, you, I, it's not how I do it, but it's how a lot of people do it. Not bad. Oh, God. Not great. Not bad, though. I'm honestly impressed. I mean, so the reason I don't like doing it like that with fly, with a regular fly knife is because it's harder to get... I feel like it takes longer to get those bones out that that way instead of just... Yeah, the ribcage instead of just flying around them. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. With an electric, though, like, all day. Yeah. You just, like, go like this, and then like this. Yeah, and just kind of follow it down, and then go around the... But, dude, do it your way. You did good on that one. Yeah, but it wasn't it's shitty. so hard to... Yeah, to get those. 
put him out of his miser Missouri. Missouri River. Put him out of his Missouri. Maybe we'll catch a fish while we're cooking fish. That would be nice, actually. Yeah. Maybe we could do that. Then we could let it go into the grease <laughs> hole. Grease release. Grease release. This is brutal. It's kind of brutal. You gotta respect the game, though. What are you doing? So that we can save on meat? Yeah, you should probably do this bigger one. Okay. I mean, that wasn't horrible. That's pretty bad. That amazing. So, oh, shebang. Good luck here. I don't even have to look, like you just go until you hit those bones. Mm -hmm. I kind of tear it right here, put my knife here. Wow, that was way better. Yeah. A lot of practice. A lot of catching cooks. Holy cow, dude. Like and subscribe. Swipe up. Not clickbait, new PB. All right, dudes, we got the heater ripping. Obviously, we're using the Buddy Flex cooker today. This thing's pretty awesome. I'm kind of actually starting to get hungry now. I did just want to leave, but I had to poop really bad, and now it's gone. Here, what does this sound like? Oh, I don't notice a difference when I fry with veg oil versus canola oil. I like peanut oil. Okay, yes, I'll agree with you. Peanut oil is super sick, whatever. But if you're frying veg oil... At least fish or anything that deserves to be fried, you're a monster. That is an excessive amount of grease. Oh. <laughs> I think you got carried away with your rant. Yeah. Mavi has the shore lunch, Cajun shore lunch in the Tupperware? Yeah, it's just like a glass Tupperware jar thing. We're about to get that fish frying, but this is what we got going on today. Bam, best buns known to man, King Hawaiian hamburger buns, and and if you don't know, we're making fish sandwiches for breakfast. Little Velveeta slices, tartar sauce, lettuce. That's all you need. <gasps> I did forget something. What? A tomato. Oh, dang. Yeah. That's all right, though. All right, dudes, Mavs. <laughs> what? <laughs> all right, dudes, Mavs, brushing his teeth. <laughs> this has got to be done. I'm going to check this one, Mav. Ready. Yeah, that's good. Get her going. All right, I'm gonna make this nice and quick. All right. He's gonna cook the rest of these. I'm just gonna turn this back on when we're eating these suckers. I think this is the first catch and cook I've done this year without catching a fish while I cook the fish. I swear to God, oh. I do it every time. I try to kind of make that a thing. Is that quite a bit enough? Is that one mine? Yeah. No, a little more. Get some on that fish too. Yeah. Shake me, dude. Mm-hmm. All right, bro, me goes. Get a little close-up action on that sucker. Yo, the Hawaiian bread. Pretty good. Like, you ever, have you ever had a... You guys can chime in on this, too. Have you ever had a big fish from Burger King? Mm-mm. It's just like that because I'm pretty sure they use some type of Hawaiian bread. It's bomb. All right, let's try it out. Best fish sandwich probably of the season. Gabby, did you have fun? I have fun. You, t you regret anything? Uh, Any regrets? Not bringing more straps for the house mm -hmm. and more anchors. Mm -hmm. And maybe I should have brought my snowmobile because it was a little further to walk than we thought. My regret is I wish we got here a little bit earlier. Is that good? Can they see me? I wish we got here a little bit earlier just so that we could fish and then set up the portable, but it was like, you guys, you guys know the issue. But anyways, I think I'm going to end this video here. Uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully it's kind of good. Like I said, we didn't really catch much fish, so yeah, I'm not sure what I'm all going to include, but yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys haven't already heard of this guy, Mavi Outdoors, you probably have, but if you haven't, Go check out his channel. He has a YouTube channel also where he does like basically just camping and camping, and hunting, and, hunting yeah. just badass stuff pretty much. So yeah, I'll leave him down below and subscribe to me if you guys enjoyed this video and that's it. Bye. You guys got to start fishing more. You guys start fishing more. Hit that. You got to start fishing more.